Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel and today I'm gonna be doing a tag video and this one is called a military wife tag. So yes, I am a military wife and my husband is in US Navy and he's a corpsman. I love doing these tag videos because you get to know more um, of a person a little bit better I guess. So yes, let's get started with this. First is how did you did you and your spouse met or meet? So me and my husband we met in Okinawa, Japan. I have a girlfriend. She's my she's a friend, and um, she has a boyfriend. And that boyfriend of hers and my husband they work together. So we went to a party, and yeah, that's how we meet. <laughs> and second question is, how old were you when you two met? Um, he was, I think he was 20, yeah, the first time we met he was 27 and I was 25. And number three, how long have you been together? We've been together, we were married for four years and we were like boyfriend for a year, boyfriend and girlfriend for a year and yeah, five years, let's say five, yeah, five years. So, where are you and your spouse originally from? from? He's from Coro I'm Corona, California, and I'm from Philippines, obviously. <laughs> so, number five, how did you feel about him joining the military? Um, when we met, he was all he's already in military, so I was actually um, how do you call this? I was actually adjusted to it because you know he was already in the military, and I love being in military, so. Yeah. Number five. Ah, uh, number six. Where did your spouse go to basic training? Oh, I don't know where he went to basic training. He said he went to Chicago for that. And number seven. Has your spouse ever been deployed? No, he's never been deployed. We thought that he was gonna go on deployment, but then again, um, it it didn't push through. Number. Eight, ever been to his promotion ceremonies? Yes, I've been once um, when he, he picked up as an E6. How long have you been a military wife? Four years. I've been a military wife for four years. Did you marry him before or after he joined? I married him after he joined me. How did your husband <laughs> propose? How did he propose? Um, we were eating. Um, somewhere and then he just popped the question right there and <laughs> where did you get married we got married in okinawa japan how old were you two when you got married um i think i was 27 28 yeah 27 or 28 when he was like 30 yeah 30 number 14 did he wear his uniform on his wedding now they know he didn't wear his uniform because we were in Shaksho. Um, that's like a city hall in Japan. So we got married there. And in Japan, it's it's so different when you get married because you just go there. You could be wearing jeans and just you know sign a paper there. And that's it. You guys got married. Where are you and your spouse currently stationed? We were currently stationed in Camp Tendulkot. Do, do you live on base? No, we don't live on base. I always wanted to live on base because I think I'll get to know more persons there and I'll, I'll get to have friends. So yeah, I always keep telling my husband I want to live on base but he said instead he bought a house. <laughs> but it's okay, I guess. How long were you married when you had how long were you married when you had to go through your first separation? Oh no, we haven't been separated yet. I think yeah, we haven't been separated. But I think when we, I went home to Philippines to visit my son and to wait for my visa. Um, I was there in Philippines for two months, so that I would say that would be our first separation. What is your favorite favorite base so far? Oh, my favorite base so far would be. The Balboa, Balboa one in San Diego because their exchange there is so is so big. They even have Mac counter, um, Anastasia one makeup, right? I'm talking about makeup. Yeah, I would say the 
Navy Exchange in San Diego or in Balboa. I love that one. Number 19. Do you think your spouse looks good in his uniform? Yeah, I love I love him when he's in uniform. <laughs> Do you think military life is more advanced than civilian life? Um, I can't personally answer that because as you guys know, as I said earlier, when I met him, he's already in military, so I don't know yet what it is being in civilian life. Number 21. Do you like the benefits you receive as a military dependent? Yes, I love the benefits as a military dependent because I I, I get to get military discount, like for instance, in Forever 21. <laughs> yep. 10% and in Payless, they have, I think they also give military discount too and if you go shop on base, they're cheaper, like, like especially in this cosmetics again, cosmetics, they give 20% cheaper and no tax, even like the groceries, you go our groceries on base because it's cheaper and you get to save more money and especially with the healthcare as well or health insurance, will put will for full coverage, you know how expensive it is having a full coverage insurance. So, yes, I love being in military. Do you have a lot of military? Do you have a lot of military wife friends? Um, I can't personally say that I have a lot of military wife friends because some of my friends are back in Okinawa we're like more in a different place so but here um no I don't have a lot of military white friends but I'll say si Seroko hi sis we're friends but we haven't met personally yet but I'll say she's my friend she's also a military wife what is the hardest part of the military wife life the hardest part is I would always say this is when you're in military or with my husband me they're always 24 hour, you know, on duty or on call. So sometimes I feel that it's always like work comes first before us. I'm not saying that that work comes first before that, but it's always on 24 hour call. My husband is such a hardworking person. He would always think about his junior sailors, which I'm proud of him too. <laughs> but that's just what I. That's just what's the hardest being in military because he's always 24 hour on call and um, I would say that he's a government property so it's like the government owns him so but overall like as I said <laughs> tell him that as long as it is good for your career I'm 100% on your back even though he was got, he was supposed to be deployed right when he said it and I he told me that if it was good for his career I said okay go ahead if that's what makes you happy then go so yeah that's all for my military wife tag and if you're a military wife I'll, I'm tagging you I hope you had fun and I hope you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and if you have any comments or questions, just leave it in the comment section down below, and I hope to see you soon in my next video. Bye!